frivolous lawsuits. Hey, we've often heard the term, do they exist and does the law do anything about them? Well, let's take a look at this week's case. This week's case involves a real lawyer, a guy by the name of Mark Halpern, practiced in Pennsylvania. And there he represented a client with a case against another lawyer, another lawyer. Well, that case was eventually resolved, but the lawyer that the case was brought against then brought claim against Mark Halpern and his client, contending that the case which was eventually settled without any real payment being made by the lawyer, was a case without merit. It was a frivolous case. And he brought claim under a specific statute in Pennsylvania called the Dragonetti statute, which basically was enacted by the legislature in Pennsylvania to bring an end to any kind of frivolous lawsuit or anything like it. So he brought claim against Mark Halprin, saying the lawsuit you filed was without any merit, it was frivolous. That case that he then brought against him went to a jury trial, and the jury then heard the evidence and found that Mark Halprin did not properly bring that lawsuit, that for all intents and purposes it was without any merit, and found that he was liable for all the expenses and also for the kind of real hassles that the lawyer who was sued had to go through, and the jury found that Mark Halprin had to pay $1.7 million in punitive damages. Those are damages designed to punish him for bringing a, what some people would say, was a frivolous lawsuit. Okay, now this case is on appeal. This case is on appeal. And there's some question as to whether this particular statute, again, the Dragonetti statute in Pennsylvania, is in fact constitutional. And we'll find out what happens as this case works its way through the appellate system in Pennsylvania. But the important thing to learn from this case is a very important thing, and that is there does exist in different forms, in different ways, in different states, various statutes, various laws, sometimes it's in the civil code, sometimes it's in the code of civil procedure, whatever, but various, various statutes which exist, rules that exist, that are intended to penalize people who bring frivolous lawsuits. And very candidly, folks, that is why we frequently don't see, quote, frivolous lawsuits. Because if it's truly a lawsuit without any merit, boy, oh boy, oh boy, the guy or gal that brings that lawsuit can be on the hook for some very substantial dollars as we see in this very case. All right, we bring you this case as we bring you cases every week so you understand how the law works. I'm David Allen.